What's going on guys? Mancake here, and as you can tell by this early lag and probably the title to this video, I'm not playing an association game as I had originally planned to upload today, but uh, I am playing a team up pickup game and I'll get more into that later. I'm actually playing with a few of my friends on PSN, one of them being Shempy, he's playing as Rondo, I'm Paul Pierce. We've got Austin5 playing as The Four, uh, Pau Gasol and Lamar Odom for the Lakers, and uh, some random guy we don't know is playing as Kobe Bryant. Anyway, if you haven't played this game mode before, it can be really fun and really lame at the same time. I've gotten stuck on some really bad teams with a bunch of bad players uh, that, you know, wasn't necessarily fun, but I've also been stuck playing as Dwayne Wade or LeBron or some crazy amazing player, and it's kind of fun. And you can also meet some really cool players on here. I met some of my original crew members way back in the day before Great Story Bro, and uh, we're still friends to this date. And, uh, you know, you can meet some cool people here. You can get stuck playing as a really bad team like the Bucks. No offense to Bucks fans. Uh, you know, you get stuck playing as Carlos Delfino. And, you know, there's not much to admire other than his super gelled hair. Uh, so, you know, it can be boring, but it's still kind of fun on occasion. We like to mix things up here. And, and I realize there's a bunch of you out there probably saying, hey, wait, I played this with them before. How come they didn't upload our videos? And for that, I apologize. I really didn't get around to uploading any of these videos in the past, even though I could have. And... You know, that's probably going to change. I want to get some more involvement with you guys here uh, up on our channel. Getting back to that association game discussion, uh, I'd wanted to upload one today, and I was at a great portion of my schedule where I was playing the Oklahoma City Thunder. But I swear to God, it is the hardest matchup I've ever played in 2K10. They picked up Big Z, and for whatever reason, their starting five just matches up perfectly against me, and Kevin Durant is just unstoppable. And I kept getting to about halftime, and... I was so upset with myself because I was playing so bad and Kevin Durant would have like 25 points, 15 rebounds in halftime and it just made me pull my hair out that I would usually just let the PS3 sit, come back and decide that I didn't want to finish the game and you know I'm going to finish it here at some point but uh, I really want to at least give them a good go and if I lose, I lose but you know I didn't have the patience to finish that game today. I wanted to get a video up for you guys to uh, watch here and I'll hopefully have that up here sometime this weekend and maybe I'll get Shumpy to join me for that matchup because it is crazy fun but crazy difficult at the same time and here we've got a little interesting series Rondo misses a pretty easy layup and then Perkins playing some amazing defense stopping Kobe but Paul Gasol picks up the loose ball and he misses as well just a crazy series of misses here and you know it's done a good first half and I really really lives up to the Celtics Lakers rivalry and there's a great layup by Ray Allen and I kind of let him with that pass there, but they get me right back with a lead pass of their own right to Ron Artest, and he lays it up. And, uh, you know, we're just chilling here. I'm getting in position on offense trying to set a pick, and Rondo, Shempy, just launches it and drains it. Definitely worth another look. I later found out that he was uh, trying to switch players and sub in Nate Robinson. He was on the phone, and he accidentally slipped and hit square and just drains it from three-quarters court. And you know things are going well when Rondo hits that. And even Austin Five on the other team admires that shot by that uh, PSN message you can see there. And, uh, well, it was really just crazy luck. And sometimes you need that. But, uh, you know, this has been a good game so far. And Bynum gets the easy tip in. It's really close. Uh, keep going back and forth here. And Shempy finds Ray Allen in the corner. You're going to see a lot of that this game. And you already have. He's just been a stud so far this game. And, uh... I realize I really haven't been talking too much about the game itself, but, you know, I really just wanted to connect with you guys one-on-one, -on -one, heart to heart, man to man, uh, no homo, but, uh, you know, it's just a game where we're really messing around and thought it'd be a good video to use to post uh, while I uh, discuss this because, you know, this is really the best way you guys can play against us. Uh, we really don't have time to play everybody one on one, and we don't even have time to play this every day. But uh, you know, when there are days that uh, we aren't doing stuff, this is a great way to get involved, and I can play multiple people at once this way. And you know, you might get a video on YouTube here, and uh, you never know. Uh, I won't guarantee it, but you know, if we're having fun and it's a good game that's uh, entertaining, we'll post it. And uh, you know, you notice Luke Walton's now in the game. That is uh. I really upset Luke Walton. He's intentionally fouling like mad. He's the guy we don't know, and he's he's the guy who also was playing as Kobe Bryant. He doesn't sub Kobe in for pretty much the rest of the game. I don't know what's up with that. I'm pretty sure he has a man crush on him, but Shampy gets him right back with a sweet flush from Rondo over about three of the Lakers there, and, you know, looks like we're about to pull away, but Bynum gets a tip slam of his own, and, uh, 
you know, it's going all right so far. I'm finally deciding to get a little bit more involved in the offense here, and I post up, which leaves Rondo wide open on the baseline there for the jumper, and Chempy just drains it. And, uh, you know, you can look forward to uh, some more of these videos, hopefully, and uh, I believe I played one right after this, which is going to be uploaded on another channel. And I played a little bit better, but I still really sucked it up on uh, defense, and you can watch me get dominated there. Uh, I think I was playing as Kobe Bryant, and... Uh, I'll put uh, that up as the video response if it gets uploaded. I think it'll probably be uploaded tomorrow if you want to check that out. And threw a pretty sick spin move down there if you ask me. And we're really starting to pull away now. I've kind of started to get more uh, involved on offense. But Derek Fisher is hitting some crazy tough shots like he usually does in the fourth quarter of these really clutch games. And Champy's playing like a true point guard, finding Ray Allen in the corner there, being patient. And it's just been a fun game. And. Uh, like I said, I've played a bunch of these with you guys in the past. I had some really fun matchups, and you know, hopefully we can continue to post these towards the end of 2K10 and uh, you know, right into 2K11 if the servers are working, God willing, and uh, you know, pretty much sealing this game up here. Champy's on the break. We got the inbound steal off of the uh, inbounds play, and he throws an oop up to Ray Allen. And, uh, you know, we're doing really well at this point. We pretty much sealed the game, but Austin 5 isn't giving up without a uh, fight here. He's still playing tough with uh, Lamar Odom, and, you know, I'm just trying to do my own thing here. But the computer-controlled Ron Artest is destroying me there in the post, but Kempi's playing like the real Rajon Rondo, being in the right place at the right time and cleaning up that uh, loose ball and putting it in for the easy layup. And like I said, Austin 5 is trying to... Fight, fight in this game still, but it's pretty much over. Uh, you know, last seconds here. I don't really need to shoot, but I'm going to shoot again because I've had a terrible offensive game, and uh, that's pretty much the game, and I believe Shempy was the player of the game. And uh, nonetheless, uh, let me know what you guys think, and uh, hopefully tomorrow, sometime I believe on Friday or Saturday, I'll have uh, that uploaded, or the video response, sorry, on the bottom of the screen, and check that out. Uh, pretty cool kid, and uh, maybe you'll see some more videos from him with him in the future. You never know, and uh, yeah. Later, guys.